attendees of SELC should make sure they're ready to participate because it's really a vocal and kind of hands-on experience. Patience, um, uh, an open mind, and no really expectations for going. Don't be afraid to try new things. In order to get the full experience of SDLC, you really have to jump into the conversation. You have to put yourself out there too, and you have to stay open-minded to everyone else's opinion, but you also have to be open to share. more like confident in my identity because I don't know many kids who are in the same situation as me like going to private school a lot of the people outside of school with this similar identity as me um, don't go to private school and seeing like that oh, like a thousand of those kids was just very and like empowering and it just made you more like stronger and everything and just like oh I'm not in this alone basically I think that afterwards it was kind of a shock as to how like I kind of perceived myself and everything around me but then like gradually over time, it wasn't that it necessarily like changed me, but it kind of like, it did in a way because it formed like a new sense of self. And I definitely felt way more comfortable with who I am and just all of these things that I definitely didn't know about myself, I now know. It made me realize that there are different types of people in this world and that no matter what differences there are, whether it be race, um, ethnicity, um, sexual orientation, we still come together as a community. I think the most surprising thing about the conference was the impact that every single thing had on um, whether the activities were very vocal, whether it was discussions, whether they were silent activities where you were moving around the room, um, everything had an impact. How many people like go through the same things that we go through and how many people are like minorities at private schools and like don't have like a lot of money and things like that and we all like go through the same things so it's kind of like comforting to know that you're not like alone how people were just like willing to have a conversation with like anybody like it wasn't weird to go up to people at like lunch or just say hi to somebody who's random or just like strike up a conversation it was just like really normal benefit from SDLC would be people who are either struggling with their identity or are struggling with like getting leadership um, skills. Anybody who's like maybe unsure of who they are or where they fit in, that would definitely be the main group I would like support to go. But I also think that anybody who's just trying to become a better leader overall would definitely benefit. That people who not only are diverse in their like personal identity but also who care about others' diversity, what's going on in the world, in their school communities, they have to want to promote change. Moments when you're there that you're going to be uncomfortable. And my biggest thing would be to, while you're uncomfortable, reflect on it, uh, think about why you're uncomfortable, and how you can kind of grow from that. SDLC is like a great opportunity to find yourself and to um, be comfortable with who you are. Enjoy it. It goes by quick. Work hard and try to stay open-minded to different things because everyone's different at the conference, which is one thing that brings it together and makes it work so well. Be outgoing because you don't really see your friends too much when you go there, but you have to be able to make new friends. And those, friends, those friendships will last a while too.